Wow, look at that. We're on the same page. Wow. <laughs> Happy birthday, baby. Heard you're about to become a YouTuber listen, again. Listen, listen, we don't know, but 2021's looking bright. Uh, do you think? Yeah. Fine. Fine. You got your camera? I forgot. Why don't you practice saying it into the camera? Just say it. I need to hold it, though. Watch the name of the baby. Happy birthday, baby. Birthday, thank you. Yeah. Oh, rock, paper, scissors. So someone's going to throw rock and someone's going to throw paper. Somebody's going to get caught off guard. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel you. Who do you think that's going to be? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, bro. I don't know. I know where your loyalty I, I, lies. I need we to have to go. <laughs> Stop. Look at <laughs> What do you? Um, I'm fucking. I'm excited. I'm just really, really excited. I either have already or will have sex with every human being that lives in this house. No, wait. <laughs> and it's just David. David might be staying there too. So David, spread the. I'm gonna quick scope your fucking ass cheeks, David. Oh, oh, you're talking about the men too? Yeah. Oh, sure. got it, got it. It's 2021, baby. Aiden's got me. Aiden's giving me a whole new outlook on life. Bro, yeah, that sus, that sus shit is, uh, is top, it's, it's, cool. it's, cool. it's contagious, bro, it's scary. It's kind of cool. cool, and you're kind of like, Bro, because Trainwreck just hit me up too, and he, he, I sent him a voice memo just talking to him about some random shit, and he's like, if you're going to talk to me about, about like that, you better whip out that fat cock first. And I'm like, wow. like, bro, it's, it's, the sus shit is catching on. It's getting kind of scary, bro, I'm not going to lie. Edgar, Edgar streaming, come fuck me already. Peace out. Unreal. Oh, I love you. See you, bro. Think about in cigarette. think about in Australia, mm. where to be a fucking funny cunt yeah. is, is the thing. best thing in the. Yeah. Do you know how many DMs I get a, a day cunt. that are like, "You're my favorite fucking cunt on the internet." Yeah, you cunt say that shit in the United fun. States, you are dead. I yeah, still love bad. saying cunt. I'm not gonna lie, I love cunt. cunt. I like, no, I feel like cunt is one that has lost its meaning for sure. Which is out amazing. here, yeah, I've it's slowly cunt. withering bro, away. Yeah. Up, oh my god, that was the nuke. That's the bit. It's 100%. <laughs> yeah. Yo, you're in a fight with your girl, or you're a fuck god for You're a your cunt. Mom, your mom. She's, She's out. Dog. She's out the door. As soon as you, you drop that over. shit, it's fucking over. You call over, your mom a dude. fucking cunt. Over. You're getting, your dad's coming home. He's beating your ass. Your big brother's in the next room. He's beating your ass. She's fucking not fucking with you. Cunt was bad. It was the one word. It was bad. It was always the one word. Like, if, you, if you got a fan, is kind of a piece of shit. <laughs> I love you, Tan. I'm just kidding. You're a great. Oh, no, hold on. She did you and her ever have a thing? Do we ever have a thing? Yeah. Elaborate. <laughs> have you ever had sex with Tana? Um, <laughs> I told you you had to fucking ease into this. You know, I'm not good at easing into it. That's my girl. Tan is the homie. Yeah. I, I honestly, to be real with you, I don't remember. Answer. I don't remember. Really? <laughs> yeah. Fuck, dude. But, no, but that's you a weird situation for you to be in because your former nemesis is now fake wait, marrying. Wait, did I actually just admit to, did this just happen? You Listen, me. oh my fucking God. It's my turn to talk. Let me talk. What you're about to say is. Killer Keen Star, let's yeah, get right. right into the news. <laughs> oh my God. Is she going to be mad? Probably. No. Gonna, She's well, got a TV show to promote. Context, she could use a little context, anger. Context, context. Oh my God, Tana, I am sorry. Alyssa, I am so sorry. I love you dearly. No, no. The, be happy every day. Be happy. That's if it. you want to be a scumbag and run around and cream pie every day, <laughs> you gotta to understand too. You gotta to be responsible and understand that there's consequences for your fucking actions. Yeah, I would suggest that a crazy man lives a crazy life and a normal man lives a normal life. Ooh. And I don't want to live a normal life. I love you, bro. You like that? Yeah, I, I like love it. That was nice. nice. As long as this, that should be a t-shirt. Real shit, though. There's so many policies and politics. If we just lived in a world where everyone was free to do whatever the fuck they want so long as they didn't hurt anybody else or fuck with anybody else's happiness in the process, you should be able to do whatever the fuck you yeah. want. Yeah, that's a utopia, bro. Yeah, That's a like, perfect life. It's very, very, it's super simple. There's just too many sick people, so that'll never happen. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. They just want to hurt other And there's people. too many Karens who see somebody having fun, see somebody doing cool shit and have like, an issue with it. <laughs> <laughs> I love him. He's like my family, but he's like, you know, your fuck up cousin who yeah. like, it's like, that's Steve. Where do you make this shit up? He got a little bit oh, out of none line. None of this is even true. It's all 100%. <laughs> it is true. Mike's only saying that because he's in debt too. He's yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> Mike, just, I have I He just took me to dinner and we're chilling. <laughs> and he's trying to get on your good side. Man, Mike, I haven't seen you since the wedding. That's how long it's been. Oh, my life is completely different now, man. I'm wifed up. I got a girlfriend. You're married? I'm I might as well be, bro. I'm gonna Dude. be I'm gonna be his real life translator. Say it again. Uh, my life's I different. Got a, my life's different. I got a girlfriend now. <laughs> I lost my dick in a crazy accident. Oh, the only oh reason I God. even left the house is because Banks was coming out, so I said I'll come out for a little bit, but I'm, I'm, I'm Can fucking, we gas each other out for a second? I'm I love this though. That's that's good. That's good. I had a few vodka rebels. He had a couple Coca Colas. Okay, I no, like it. No, no, sober 2020, still going strong. Man, okay, I know, it's crazy, bro. That's dope, man. Buy the Fifth Vital. It's on Amazon. It's one of the fucking. It's his book. And look out for internet gangsters and, it's coming at you. Yeah, soon. we're making a cartoon. Internet. No one but knows. Also, this is an also, exclusive. Okay. Not one person knows the Fifth about this Vital. Yet. He killed it. It's his book. It's a personal memoir. It's a uh, autobiography. Bro, this isn't an watch out! Watch out for the Sixth Vital. It's coming wow. out next <laughs> month. So what it's is, a story about. My life. <laughs> well, you're, uh, the, okay. No, he's a liar. Okay. He's a liar. I swear to fucking it's God. It's on Amazon. It's on okay. Amazon. So, Get on Amazon. <laughs> man, 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 man. Okay. So how's everything going on Impulsive? Man, Impulsive's great. Everything's Mom's good. Mom's basement. Mom's Two basement. Two podcasters. <laughs> we're just pod. We're East Coast scumbags turned podcasters. Where, where's Honestly, it? I'll, do, I'll let you in on a secret. Don't oh. tell anybody okay. I said this, right. but we figured out how to just ski. So much money uh -huh. out of Hollywood and the internet, like we're just running with it. I know it dude. until the fucking wheels fall off. Man, dude, wait, hey, where's your buddy Keemstar at? I don't know. He's His buddy Keemstar. He's, so, he's got Logan. You got, okay, so you got Logan and you got Keemstar. Okay. So, Shut up! Shut the fuck up! <laughs> I'm doing a fucking interview. What the Oh my god. Later, Mike. I love you, bro. I love you too. Mike, I love you. I really do. Alright, okay, you're stupid head right here. finally getting an Aspen mug. What'd you say you're finally doing acid? An Aspen mug. That I was telling mug? them about my mug collection. So, for anybody who hasn't been on one before, this is the inside of a private jet. It's got a bed in the back that me and Lana are gonna be using in the no, next we're couple not. minutes. Yes, we are. If you've ever been to Aspen, the airport's gnarly. Heavy winds, like it's it's the most dangerous airport in America. So, we're gonna probably land at Rifle and then it's a 45 minute drive. I just put ground transportation at both locations. The pilots make the decision in the air and then we'll be good. Bang is freaking out right now. I don't do well flying. <laughs> Bang is freaking out as soon as he said the most dangerous airport in America. Bang is like. Hey, He's the most dangerous airport in America. Yeah, <laughs> up in the air, I'll be fine. I'm not going to be weird the whole flight. Man, that shit straight caught him just. <laughs> you guys are filming right now? Yeah, we're filming a little bit for the new episode. See, people still fuck with me. They still know who I am. Yo, question for you. Do you want Banks to start uh, vlogging again? You should, yeah. What do you think about the fact that he just gave up on life completely? It's pretty <laughs> Up, right? I love you. Oh, you want a picture of me too? The second best vlogger on the trip. Right. <laughs> this is what we should do. Oh, I want to no, show. No, hold on, I want. This is funny. Me and you should join forces and try to do a meet and greet. We'll do it at the exact same place and time, but like right across the street from Lana, and see if we can beat her. We can't. I know <laughs> we, we can't. can't. I know we, we cannot. That's why it's funny. Hard cut to nobody around us. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Squarepants, how do you explain all this success? Uh. I don't know. I know you guys know this, but I have a really bad ankle. Last night after dinner, I didn't feel like walking home, so Banks pushed me in a wheelchair, except he pushed me off a curb. Here's the footage of that. Oh, Thank you so much. Oh, okay. I love you too. Oh, oh shit! Hey. Help! 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 <laughs> Honestly, it had nothing to do with your ankle. I thought it was funny because you're like 56 now. Hey, Banks. Hi. I know because I've been with my girlfriend a lot. You're later. gonna give me the bear that you got in Starbucks for her. I got you this like you bear. Got you. <laughs> <laughs> thank, Mike. Thank you, dude. You're my fucking. You're the best, dude. All right, let's fucking go. <laughs> so as we're walking through dog shit, you just stepped in straight up dog shit. Imagine you just take your dog to the park one day, and all of a sudden you look, and Lana Rhodes is petting your dog. Yeah, that's funny. That's funny. <laughs> Hi. Hi guys. Look at these little couches. Oh hey there. Oh it's Kong. Hey, I know we just met. Stop. But what I was thinking was <laughs> to get to know you better, I got you the all right, so we're on the mountain. Got a little bit of snow overnight last night, couple inches. I'm here with manager Jeff and Tom from Phase Clan. Hear me? I have a dried up nut on my fucking left arm. Why do you have a cum stain on your arm? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. All right. As I mentioned, Cloud Gang 2.0. Can't even. No. What do you want me to call it? What do you want me to call it? It's not that. All right, you give me a totally new. Like what? I don't know. 
<laughs> All right, I don't know. So one point oh. wouldn't be complete without this other big motherfucker right here. He's gonna be the one helping me put it together. We're gonna be talking about it a lot over the next you few months, good. but look at this guy. Oh, you're little. <laughs> I can't believe it, bro. How are you? So this is before like I was streaming every day and shit. I basically told this motherfucker like you you put gaming on the map like you fucking did it. What's yeah. up, pussy lips? Pussy lips? Who are you talking to? Yeah, You're talking the... to you. <laughs> I'm here now. I'm here in person. Yeah, what up? Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll stab you. No, let's stop. Chirp it, chirp it, chirp it. How tall are you? Six, six, because he's been playing this whole time. I've been friends with him. He's six one. I measured him. Six the other foot, day. six he's one. Five yes, eleven he's... and three four. Right. All right, man. So yeah, Wait, so, no, I'll let me lead. I'm you're gonna be way better to lead on my show. show. I can lead on your show. It's a new segment. It's called Remedial Tasks, where I do like just <laughs> random shit with YouTubers. And so today we're doing grocery shopping with banks. Can I'm go so get some sorry, snacks. Man. We're yeah, doing this is the barbecue this, aisle. Oh, we're not getting barbecue. Food. Fuck, you don't need any charcoal? No. All right, so let's switch it up there. Okay, there's booze. Okay. <laughs> so you got some classic American in there. You drink a lot of Americana. You drink a lot of domestics. Bud Light's great when you when you want a water, but you don't want to be a <laughs> This is a pretty important one. Oh, yeah. 100%. What's your favorite lunch meat? Favorite lunch meat? I like, uh, I get the spice. I like spicy meat. Spicy meat. Yeah, boy. I like that too. Like, uh, like a pepper. Well, my day to day, turkey. Turkey. Speaking of girls, speaking of spicy salami, and speaking of the Tifu tweet, you recently had a pretty high profile breakup. As we said earlier, we're going to our favorite adult film star, Riley, fill in the blanks. Like her. Birthday party. Like <laughs> this is as close to Riley as you this can is, get in, a, in the bread section. In the bread section. <laughs> All right, so should we get her a cake? Yeah, I'm with that. Happy you birthday, Riley. Riley. We got you a cake. <laughs> <laughs> None of this can make the cut, dude. You're such a It should, dude. You Are you used to this, this little symbol? No, I don't get that symbol. What do you get? Green. You're always green? Or I don't upload. <laughs> you're like, yo, if you're not paying me ad money, you're not, you're not the seeing the content. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Like, I'm trying to make fun content that people want to watch, like adult stuff, but at the same time, like, I want to, I, I need enough, you know how much money it costs to keep this much bread in the house with the amount of toast I go through on the show? Like just the bread alone? Mike, what the f are you talking about? Let's go. All right. Um, we're going to Japan. That's another cool thing. Me, Tommy, Adapt, and the Rice are all going to Japan. You going to Tokyo? End of August, yeah. Yeah, historically that's not been the best place for us. Uh, but hopefully you guys have better luck there. Wait, what are you talking about? I don't know if where you were on January 1st, 20. Oh, look, Sunny D. It's not orange juice. Listen, if that. I open up your fridge, by the way, and this is the orange juice you have in there, I'm taking it and smash it. Just smash what it right on the ground. That's, that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool, because it's that, just an orange, bro, but he's just like a happy orange, bro. For kids, too. It's funny, too, because if you think about it, like, that orange shouldn't even be happy, bro, because he's, he's, he's been good. chopped up. Yeah, so we got turkey, margarine spray, a 12-pack of Bud Light, like, three bags of chips. I'm putting this back. A cake for Riley Reed. And uh, and some wet wipes. Yeah, I think I think, I think we're in pretty good shape, dude. Yeah, I appreciate you doing a remedial task with me, bro. You're definitely. I'll, I'll be back soon. A night shifter, just like us, and uh, I love you, bro. I'm I'm excited, man. Yeah, we're about to send it. Tonight's gonna be fun. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you got to talk to him. Do you feel better now? I just need you to promise me one thing. What's so. up? You're not gonna hang out with Banks anymore. Yeah, that's fine. You promise? Yeah. A few inches later. The <laughs> Look at me, bro. I'm a fucking natural. Yo, it's been a minute. Please. We're fucking chilling. Listen, what's grave in the Navy, little baby? It's your boy, Faze. Oh! oh! You should leave this with me for like a week. <laughs> Happily. What are we doing today, boys? Being an East Coast scumbag, a fellow East Coast Wendy's scumbag. Wendy's is kind of a big deal. Already. Wendy's is a big fucking deal. Like, I worked at a gas station that was connected to a Wendy's. Really? Yeah. Fire. Like, how would you, you would rank it pretty high on No, it's garbage. R just complete shit. Yeah, it's <laughs> the reason why I'm saying this right now is this kid, Perry Jowsey, has never had in Wendy's before. Never. never in his life. Can you imagine that? Can you imagine? That's like never having sex, bro. Where really bad sex. <laughs> it's like it never.
never having really bad sex. Oh, let me, let me that. That's like saying you've never fucked a hooker. That's like saying you've never fucked a hooker, bro. Today you're gonna. I haven't done that either. All right, well today you're gonna fuck a hooker. We should handle that later. <laughs> all right, so when it comes to Wendy's, yes. there's a lot of options, all right? But the most important units, junior bacon cheeseburger, <laughs> spicy nuggets, the fries are solid, and most importantly. What is that? This is an American tradition right here. You take the frosty, the fries. It's been a minute since I've done this. Wow. Oh. Before we get too far, we also have the largest thing offered at Wendy's, the triple Baconator, There's dude. Like 6,000 calories. There's like an entire cow on that thing, dude. Are you serious? <laughs> Yo, should I dip this in the Frosty? <laughs> yeah, you Bring should, me the should, chocolate you should, you Frosty. Should. Triple Baconator chocolate Frosty. You did it. Oh my God. That's aggressive. <sighs> Fire, bro. It's like when well, it's I'll like dive and I'll do it. I'll it's like it. sweet and salty, bro. <laughs> bro, you see that shit? That's why Francesca don't fuck with you. <laughs> <laughs> I want to talk a little bit of shit with you guys. Banks is an enigma. No one knows where he is. What is going on with you, bro? Are you? I'm going I'm through some shit. I've been going through some shit for like 28 years. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, but how good does it feel to have the camera back in your hand? We had Nate shot on the podcast the other day. He's like, everybody misses Banks. Bro. It's cool to do things like this because this is fun. But for just for me personally, I'm being real right now too. I'm not trying to be funny. It doesn't make me happy doing it. I don't like the, the YouTube microscope. I like being in other people, people's videos though. I've always liked that. It's cool. What about streaming? I mean, God, no. no. <laughs> That's even worse. That's like there's no fall safe, like fail safe. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we can edit that out, but if yeah. we were streaming, it's like, no. You can say all kinds of horrible I'm shit, awful. bro. I'm off. How are you adjusting to your first 15 minutes of fame here, bro? Yeah, it's been pretty crazy. It's been a lot of us. I've been very busy. <laughs> the craziest thing about Banks is I met him before any of this shit happened. One of the first times I met him, we're at Hyde, and he had a tequila bottle, smashed it with another bottle, completely smashed the bottle, <laughs> in front of me and then started drinking it. And I was like, this dude's crazy. I'm always telling my girlfriend about how you're like the nicest kid, like the stand up real quiet kid. And she goes, Mike, quiet. the first time I met the fucking kid was at 11 in Miami. He threw up into a bottle of 1942 and threw it off the balcony into the crowd. And who <laughs> has these stories, you bro? And honestly, that. like, no, I did do this. That's real. <laughs> but listen, I didn't throw it off the balcony into nothingness. There's like space between, like <laughs> under the balcony, between the couches. I like threw it behind the couches <laughs> under the balcony. You know what I mean? Uh, All right, get yourself a nugget. That barbecue. Is that enough? Bullshit. Deep? Yeah, balls deep in the nugget sauce. There you go. Mm, that's really fucking good. Yo, what's your favorite thing about America so far? The women. I mean, the. <laughs> <laughs> He's bad, dude. Uh, He's oh, a bad man. <laughs> yeah, We're bad dudes for each other. <laughs> <laughs> but that's why it's bad because we both like love it, though. You know what yeah. What I mean? yeah. <laughs> Listen, we live one time. <laughs> I'm gonna try to hit him with. Some no, hit him with. The no, value. seriously though, you live once. Just cream pie everyone. <laughs> Do not do that. <laughs> Alright, finish your I back that, by the way. <laughs> no. Your girlfriend has stopped sending us cease and desist forms from her lawyers. I don't know who she is. I don't know who that is. <laughs> she sent us a cease no and desist no on the podcast. We had her on the podcast. I get a letter the next day from our legal team that's like, yo, we just got served a cease and desist from his girlfriend. <laughs> We're X, talking about X, yeah, our ex girlfriend. Ex, ex, ex. Don't get it mixed. <laughs> well, you need to behave yourself. I am. You hang out with this guy. Just cream pie everyone might not be the best policy. No, I'm not going to lie. I say that. But I don't do it. I'm looking for a relationship. <laughs> we doing flyouts? Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Look, the gang's all here. It's We're old. missing that one Asian Dude, kid and the girl that nobody knows yet. <laughs> well, a bunch of people do, but it's just on a different side of the internet than our side. I invented this whole team house thing, okay? Face House New York. Find one that came before that. I'll wait. Don't talk to fucking Elon Musk about electric cars. Don't talk to fucking <laughs> Einstein about the, uh, what's, I haven't slept all night. What is it? The, the relative theory of relativity. The, theory of relativity. Don't talk to fucking Mike about fucking porn stars. You're not going to hang out with Banks anymore. Yeah, that's fine. You promise? Yeah. Sometimes it's just, <laughs> sometimes it's just, just, you know what I mean? Don't like, talk to me about that. I know what the fuck <laughs> I'm doing and I've always done it the best. This is about to be the fucking illest shit on you. Do it on my face. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all are gonna be hilarious. Listen, 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 he's old. That's all that, you're old. Time out, time out, time out. Let's do a wide shot. <laughs> I don't need words. <laughs> you're old. Hold on, hold on, hold on, let me get. What was that? You're not funny. That's not funny. That's not funny. I am starting TikTok beef with every single TikToker. It's straight smoke. Straight smoke. <laughs> He's doing high school that talks hella shit because he knows he has his two big brothers behind on everything. Hell yeah, hell yeah. No, no, we're talking about rat beefs. This fucking kid's like, 
No, no, no. Pock and Biggie, I remember that. <laughs> no. Yo, Aiden, chill. You have the same birthday as SpongeBob. There's one person in this whole house who's on their ID, on their driver's license, has the double zeros. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. He was born in 1970, and this motherfucker <laughs> was born in 1980. What's your actual both, birthday? They're both old as shit. When you guys used to watch TV, it was black and white television. But you, got, you learned how to read on an iPad. <laughs> Like, what? <laughs> the first iPod is older than you are. That's crazy. When, when I say Carl's Jr. to you, what do you think of? Dog shit. <laughs> I think it's fucking 5 a.m. I'm surrounded by hungry, drunk girls, and I'm about to spend $100 on garbage. infinite garbage food. <laughs> okay, okay. Now, when I say Alexis Clark and Mare Bear to you, what do you automatically think of? Butt cheeks. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Mrs. Clark, as Banks said earlier when we were talking about it, probably the two best sets of cheeks on the internet. <laughs> the boy. <laughs> I rate cheeseburgers on every episode of the night shift. Wait, I thought this was an OnlyFans collab. Oh. I mean we could we could make that happen. About what? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go! Today we're gonna be eating a place called Carl's Jr., which I'm opening this first one up and it is not looking good. It's a very saucy, kind of crispy burger. I don't know about this meat. All of this already seems pretty sus to me. Mm. There's just nothing special about mm -hmm. it. That's it's the problem. It's kind of like dry. It's very dry. And I like things kind of dry, so that's- Really? Yeah. Yeah. I don't really like dry so things very much. But I am. So obviously not much juice coming out of the meat. It looks kind of like they baked a marble countertop inside a bun. And the lettuce is pretty old. It looks like it was shipped in from like Louisiana a couple months ago. Here Would you rate these buns? Which ones? Which ones? <laughs> <laughs> these buns. Oh, those ones? Oh, on the bun scale, probably like a three. Yeah. What about our buns? I think it's harsh. Fucking 50 out of 10. So I historically, infamously, sadly for a lot of the South, gave Whataburger a 4.3. I'm gonna go ahead and give Carl's Jr. a, a, a 3.6. Uh, if you're ever having a terrible night, you're depressed, <laughs> <laughs> you're anxious, and you wanna make it worse, go to Carl's Jr. On a budget, you got 10 drunk girls with you, you gotta feed them at 4 a.m. This place is open. <laughs> And they're drunk enough to not give a fuck. At that point, like, what else, what other gaming boots and it's already like that, I'm sorry. It's just, everyone's playing for second place, everybody knows that. I'm not even gonna get into it, I'm gonna start getting fired and maybe fuck with everybody. Phase up, all the fucking way. I was hooking up with some girl yesterday in Vegas on a toilet. She oh, fell off, hit her head on the wall, got mad at me and said the following sentence. That's alright, you're fat anyways. Am I fat? You gotta tell me, bro. Are you sure? I'm so fucking you're, Listen, you're daddy. Thank you. Bro. If I know anything about you, she was probably busted as fuck. <laughs> She was probably butt fing ugly fing you, you whack ass bitch. My boy's yeah. handsome. He's handsome. And by the way, I didn't get mad. Hold on, one second. Jordan, I didn't no, no, get... hold on, hold on. Right, gotta be some what do you have to say? I gotta hear this. Bro, I'm just say it. Just say it, Jordan. Say it, Jordan. Bro, just say it. Bro, happy birthday to all. You know what I'm saying? I get What? That's bro, why you interrupted this bro. interview? Bro, we gotta go downstairs. I gave the police my ID so they can get this shit going. Face bags. By the way, he's the fuck. By the way, wait. Out. Oh, look, Sunny D. Ya. Call me young dripper, call me young swaggin' babe, that's why I fuck with ya. No, I keep it going, babe, get a little richer. Dance like little Richard, smoking on Swisher. Like how I beat it up, yeah, I like I'm thicker. 